Hi everyone. Today I'm going to be doing this look. Now you know I had I couldn't let the year go out and not do something wild and crazy, so <laughs> this is what I came up with. Plus I needed to do something in blue. You know I had to do something blue. So this is the look. And I will show you what I used that you didn't see in the tutorial. Starting with the lips, I'm using another sample from House of Beauty. It's in Taboo. And it looks like this. Pretty vibrant blue. And for the cheeks, I'm using a La Femme blush in the color Grape this one there and then for highlight I'm wearing Becca's blushed copper and for nails I'm wearing two colors again a Sephora formula X polish and moon glow And on top of that, I'm wearing this glitter polish from Sally Sally Hansen. It's in Fanta C. So it's kind of like a light blue and silver glitter. And I guess that's it. <laughs> so the rest you'll see in the tutorial. Of course you can tone down this lip um, and make it a little more wearable but since the eyes are so bold I had to go with a bold lip. So I appreciate your support and love and I hope that you have an enjoyable and safe new year. Bye! So we're going to start with the Morphe brushes, 35B palette. Going to use a few colors from here. I'm not sure which ones yet. Just going to play it by ear. But I do know that I'm going to start with this color. This is in the first column. And the third one down gonna use this under the brow as the highlight it's kinda like a light beige color and I'm gonna go in with this color it's the third column and the third color down kind of in between a kind of like a coral color so I'm gonna apply that right under the highlight color to blend in the highlight right below that coral I'm gonna go in with this color at the bottom this is right in the middle of the palette the fourth column over from the front this is kinda like a darker uh, wine color so I'm gonna blend that in that's gonna deepen up the color some more Then we're going to go in with this color. It's all the way on the other side. It's a deep blue, second from the bottom. Go into the crease with that. So 
So first I'm going to go in with the light hand on it and slightly blend up. Then I'm going to take some more and go in deeper and right in the crease. Then to blend in the edge of that dark blue, I'm going to take a little bit of this purple and apply it right at the edge where the blue stops. So this is what we have so far. I'm going to be applying a pencil base to the lid. This is by Urban Decay, their 24-7 Glide On Pencil and Deviant. So I'm going to apply this all across the lid. Except for a small space on the inner tear duct area. I'm going to go in with this eyeshadow from Makeup Forever. It is ME216 Electric Blue. And I'm going to apply that on the lid on top of that base. which is pretty much the same color. <laughs> Next I'm going to apply another pencil base in the tear duct. This is another Urban Decay pencil in electric. So we're going to apply this top and bottom. Top of the base, I'm going to apply this color. It's a Aurora color from Looksy Beauty and Prom Queen, and this is a pretty frosty light blue with purple and light pink shift to it. <laughs> Some different colors, so I'm going to apply that right on top of the base. Okay, so I'm back. I went a little crazy on the lower lash line. I was trying that one technique where you got the things, little points going in the tear duct area. So I had to play with it a little bit and it's still not exactly how I wanted it. But what I did was I took um, this black liner from LA Girl. And very black. And I just took it down here to draw the initial line and then I went over it with the deviant pencil from Urban Decay so that it makes the inner tear duct pop. So once I perfect it I will do it on camera so you guys can see me do it but until then I gotta do off camera and practice with it a little bit. So next I'm going to apply a color in the waterline that's going to be Color Pop B Steam. I'm going to apply that in the waterline. And then one last element to the eye look, I'm going to apply some glitter, of course. 
And this is Magnolia Makeup Glitter in Aqua. So the color and the name speak for themselves. And I'm going to apply that in the lower lash, right in that light space area there. So I'm going to take some of my adhesive. I'm using um, eye candy liquid sugar and going to apply that right in here. Be careful not to get it in your eye. Okay, so I wanted to lighten up the water line a little bit, so I um, took Color Pop Prance in the water line to make that brighter. And I'm done tinkering around and playing around, so this is the look. <laughs> and I'm going to wear these lashes from House of Lashes. They're called Pixie Lux. And I will take them out of the package so you can see them better. And that'll be the look. Thanks for watching. Bye.